So I started with the puppet legs. So usually when building like a tabletop puppet in this way, you'd have a puppeteer on the legs, um, somebody else on the uh, uh, arm and the bum, and somebody on the head and the other arm, ideally. Obviously with just me in lockdown, I'm gonna have to do all of that with just my hands, my two hands. So the first thing I did was see if I can get those legs uh, that would have been puppeted by two hands to get puppeted by two fingers. Um, so that uh, is the first process. Okay, so I thought I'd just have a look at the legs of this puppet. So um, as you can see, they kind of lock quite nicely. This is a slightly larger version of the, um, of the prototype that I made. Basically the feet are sprung so they can kind of spring on their own and kind of adapt to any terrain that we may get outside. Just spent a little bit of time working on getting the legs working really nicely. Um, still probably a little bit of a way to go. Um, so they're kind of working now. Um, had some issues with the, uh, the feet flicking up actually as he walks. So he walks kind of like this, but it looks, looks a bit weird. So I had to kind of straighten off those. So they're really kind of rounded heels, but and now it's looking all right. Time it skips and gathers trips and heaps up at the end. Death has pressed my.